Good morning, friends and fellow traders. This is Doug Campbell with Rightway Options, and this is the morning market preparation video for February 5th, 2019. So my goodness, those bulls just refused to give up any ground yesterday. We had a little bit of pushback early in the morning, but they just simply refused to, to let go of this market and pushed hard, breaking on through yesterday. In fact, the end of the day was a substantial move right at the end of the day, pushing really strongly into the close kind of surprising I have to admit because we are so extended in this bull run but um, <laughs> fact remains the bulls um, saw no reason to pull back no reason to take a rest they wanted to go higher and as you can see really nice candle pattern here on the diamonds so let's take a look what what do we have going on here for support and resistance well first off I would probably mark something right across here as a potential resistance point we have those highs right in this area that I would watch for resistance after that point I would be looking for resistance up into this area um, uh, you know in between this zone between this there and there um, as the next resistance area in the market. Um, I got to tell you, a V bottom is something that is so extremely rare. I have a difficult time uh, trusting this V bottom. And I will tell you honestly that even though the bulls are pushing really, really hard here, I am going to maintain my discipline and be very, very careful. I know the fear of missing out is, is such a strong, strong emotion and everyone thinks, oh my gosh, I'm missing this. And the inclination is to chase into this move. If you do decide to um, add new risk right now in this market, be very careful to make sure you're planning that risk um, carefully. You do not want to end up in a situation where uh, the risk of a trade um, is far more than you expected because you kind of gave in. You gave up your discipline and gave in to that emotion, that fear of missing out. So watch that closely. Um, there's nothing wrong here in the chart whatsoever except for the fact that we have just um, just been powering higher here. Um, we're ignoring pretty much everything uh, and, uh, and just pushing and pushing and pushing to go higher. So we have a nice level of price support right in here, pushing up through there. That's a good sign. Any pullback into there would not be at all a problem. Any pullback even down into here would not be a problem really for this market to see a rest, consolidation, or pullback back into that level. That would not be at at all a problem for the market so let's watch these levels closely um, currently this morning uh, we're looking at a gap up open the market wants to continue powering higher be careful of that gap up open remember I commonly talk about uh, um, watching to make sure the buyers will support that gap before entering trades we don't want to get caught in a pop and drop where we pop up in the morning and then those institutions come in finally selling things off and you kind of get caught by chasing in to that run. So watch that closely this morning. I'm certainly not going to say that's going to happen. Right now the bulls are defying um, just everything. As a matter of fact, you know, we had... Um, Earnings from Google yesterday that disappointed investors, that Google dropping back sharply here this morning. Um, um, other, you know, uh, GOUU uh, disappointing investors dropping substantially this morning. We have STX uh, missed on earnings. Uh, disappointing, disappointing investors for a substantial drop this morning. Um, GILD. GILD missing on earnings and gapping substantially down this morning. But none of that seems to matter. Nobody seems to care. Um, the bulls certainly don't seem to care. They're completely ignoring those things and continuing to push higher. So watch that closely. Now we are getting a lot of a lift. Um, 
from a company like Apple. Apple giving us a nice lift, pushing higher yesterday. That's certainly um, alleviating some of the pressure with Apple being such a massively weighted company in the indexes. That certainly helps. And then we also saw um, Netflix yesterday finding this, the energy to, to continue its rally. So as we watch uh, some of these big techs continuing to defy some of that gravity, pushing higher, we're going to watch want to watch this closely um, even though we're ignoring so many of the other signs in the market so let's be careful with that SPY let's take a look at spies here SPY really really strong nice strong move up here breaking its downtrend looking really really good next resistance I think um, in the chart is right up here where we have that triple top there is a little bit of price resistance right through here, but we're essentially um, testing that and defying that this morning with this gap up open. So watch this area in here for that potential resistance to come into play. Let's take a look at the cues. Q's showing great strength yesterday. Nice little price pattern here as well. Price pattern I, I like to call a Fig Newton pattern where we have a, a, a light candle, a dark candle, a light candle in between. Those typically resolve themselves higher, at least for the opening uh, print. Uh, there'll be a higher print in this morning. Uh, we're looking at the Q's trying to gap up this morning. Please keep in mind it could also consolidate over here to trend. Watch these resistance levels in the chart we have some resistance right here we could move up to that fairly easily and um, you can see that there are resistance levels above that as well any pullback in this chart um, shouldn't be a major issue a pullback into this level of support would not be at all a problem a pullback into this level of price support would not change the strength of this market as a matter of fact I think that would make this rally healthier if we had a little rest or a pullback but uh, market rarely gives me what I want <laughs> it's gonna do what it wants let's take a look at IWM um, IWM, a very nice looking pattern here, holding this price support in here, looking very good, rallying up strongly. Um, once again, pay close attention to these resistance levels in the chart right up here. We've got room to move up. We do have a little bit of a level right through here, as you can see, that we could be approaching um, right now. So watch this level and in between this zone for that potential resistance to come into play. Once again, a pullback here, a pullback into this level of support would not be a problem. A pullback um, into that level of support would not be a problem. And I would even say a pullback down into here would probably not be a problem uh, so we've got um, really good bullish uh, market here very very strong and any rest or pullback I think would um, even enhance the strength of this market let's take a look at um, the VIX VIX continuing to decline. Um, here we are, just absolutely no fear in the market whatsoever, dropping and breaking down through this level of support. That's a significant level of support. So please keep in mind as we continue to sink here in uh, volatility, watch this area real closely in here for that potential that we catch that little bit of a, a bounce, a lift off of here, um, which would mean the market pulls back a little bit. But let's watch that close if we continue to sink amazing that's just truly amazing how much we have fallen um, in a straight line basically here in the market so watch that close um, I would not be surprised to see any volatility come back here soon and um, so just be careful of that don't um, don't chase is what I'm saying I guess let's take a look at t2122 I got to tell you, T2122 is defying um, anything I, I believe I've ever seen in T2122. You can take this back a long, long ways, and you're going to find it difficult to find anything that shows this kind of pattern up here staying so 
um, stretched for so long here um, in T21-22. That's a good thing for the Bulls. I got to give it to you. Uh, the Bulls are hanging in there nicely. They're showing all kinds of strength up in here, looking really, really good. But we have to admit that we are kind of stretched. So don't be surprised at all if we start to see profit taking come in at any time. It could happen anytime. It may not be today. Um, we may continue to push up in this area. Pretty amazing pattern here though, and one that I want to be a little bit careful and cautious of um, as those um, profit takers could come in at any time. Let's take a look at um, the economic calendar here. If we take a look on the calendar, we don't have a whole lot going on today. As you can see, we, we do have a PMI services um, unlikely to move the market at all. Of course, Red Book um, here this morning, unlikely to move the market at all. ISM, non-manufacturing index, has the biggest potential of moving our market today. We'll want to keep an eye on that. And then after that, we just have nothing but bond announcements and auctions um, on the calendar. So nothing major to move the market here on that. However, on the earnings calendar, we have a considerable number, about 150 companies reporting earnings today. So we'll want to keep an eye on those earnings reports as they continue to roll out. There are some very important uh, stocks going uh, planning to report today, so watch that closely. One in particular, uh, Disney. Disney is going to report today. We'll want to keep an eye on that. Looks like Disney is looking for a gap up. Perhaps they've already reported. Looking pretty strong here on Disney, so you might want to keep uh, an eye on on those earnings reports as they continue to roll out. So with that, everyone, hey, I wanna wish you all a great day. I wanna wish you great profits in your trading. And if this is the first time you've seen these videos, please do me a favor. Click that subscribe button on YouTube, the follow me button on Facebook. Click those thumbs up buttons and leave a comment. I truly appreciate that. You guys are just awesome. Thank you for doing that, supporting this channel and helping us grow. Um, remember, I do these um, in an effort to help traders. After 14 years of trading full time and nearly 30 years in the market, I do these as, as more of just um, wanting to help other traders. Um, do a better job with their preparation and thinking about the, the things for the day, being careful not to not to chase and getting caught up in that fear of missing out or um, anything along those lines. So that's the purpose of these videos. And I truly appreciate those that are supporting the channel. Thank you very, very much. So with that, let's take a look at some great looking charts. I mean, there are so many good looking charts out there. Um, it's it, it, more than you can possibly, possibly trade. First, let's take a look at um, at a couple like Home Depot. Home Depot looking very good, moving up here. I mentioned this yesterday, Rightway Options is in this trade, looking really, really good, and uh, no signs of pulling back here, um, at least at this point, looking very, very strong. A trade I'm watching for a potential entry, Valero Energy, this pink line right here is as a price alert and I really like this move up and pull back to the support area holds if it holds in this trend gives me a buy signal I will be watching for an entry into a Valero energy if you guys remember I've been talking about um, Roku um, everyone watching Roku Roku I know a lot of members of RWO took great profits in Roku yesterday as that broke out of there popping through these um, alert levels and moving right on to a nice profit. So uh, congratulations to those folks uh, that um, have traded that. I mentioned LEA yesterday and LEA continuing to potentially set up for more upside. Might want to keep an eye on LEA. Another chart that uh, many of the RWO folks um, have made money on is when, when our first alert into this trade was right here and second 
second alert in here really nice move up these are all patterns that I teach um, uh, all the time and patterns that produce really really great returns and as you can see really good money can be made in these very very simple patterns it's a pattern we call the rounded bottom breakout if you want to learn more about that get a hold of us we'd lo love to um, show you how that could be a great uh, potential uh, trade pattern for you let's also take a look at SKS SKS looking really really good you can see this has been alerted a couple times moving up and right now looking very strong if I draw a trend line on this chart you can see how beautiful that nice little trend has become um, nice buy signal yesterday um, any resting pattern in here would be okay but looks like um, SWKS wants to uh, move on through and go higher so lots and lots of really good charts to consider in your trading um, um, good patterns good trades you can see how these alerts have proved to be uh, very very uh, useful very very um, uh, good another chart that um, holding right now SQ SQ hanging in there it's not really doing as much as I had hoped it would but it's hanging in here I've got an, another alert on this trade and currently in this position and as you can see this could actually consolidate just a little bit longer before this decides to pop up on out of here but looking really really good here sq might be one for your list so everyone hey i want to wish you all a fantastic day i want to wish you great profits and let me just give you one more bonus stock that i think is a beautiful beautiful price pattern and that's right here in um, Nike you can see Nike running this nice little trend up pushing against a resistance level right here but a really nice price pattern there's that fig Newton again I um, wouldn't be at all surprised at any time to see that pop on through here so you might want to keep an eye on Nike so everyone have an awesome awesome day be safe be careful be make sure you plan your trades very very carefully don't chase too much into this rally we could easily see a pullback begin at any time consider that risk i know i will be considering uh even profit taking um, on this gap up this morning depending on how that pro, uh, price action plays itself out so um, watch that carefully and with that everyone have an awesome day and please never give up on yourself i know many of you are struggling Struggling, you know, buckle down, work hard, really focus on that price action, and you too can be uh, very successful in trading. I'm confident of that. If an old carpenter can do it, like me, I know anyone can. So, everyone, take care of yourselves. We'll talk to you all bright and early Wednesday morning. Have a great day.